Hello, my name is Dr. Michael Back. I'm one of the residents here at the University of Calgary, here to explain to you cataract D anterior vitrectomy level one. I think that these, these modules are actually one of my favorites in the new cataract D um, update from uh, VR Magic. What you have to do is you'll have to deal with a posterior capsule rupture where vitreous is now um, entering into the bag. So you first stain with triencimalone, and then one of the tricks for beginners is that you actually want to stick your vitrectomy cutter deep posterior to the posterior capsule. So you want to be able to actually um, go behind the posterior capsule and then try to slowly cut from the bottom to the top, like I'm doing in this particular video. The reason is, is that if you don't actually get all the posterior vitreous, um, one of the problems that you're going to ha have is, is that you may pull some of the vitreous from behind the posterior capsule to inside the bag, and the machine will deduct a lot of points if you do that. So if you start from the very bottom, what you're going to um, be able to avoid is pulling um, or traction on the vitreous um, and bring it forward. So here I'm just chasing after a little bit of the rest of the uh, vitreous that's in the anterior chamber, and that looks pretty clean. However, you don't want to stop there and start going after the cortex. You want to restain with the triencimalone, and even you can push your cannula to the bottom and then try to stain a bit of the posterior vitreous as well. So now I'm cleaning up um, and just aspirating the triencimalone just to see if there's any vitreous left and you can tell that there isn't. Be very careful when you're near the posterior vitreous um, and the posterior capsule because you may accidentally chew up a bit of the capsule. So now I'm just adjusting my OR machine settings and I prefer to have a bimanual uh, irrigation aspiration tool for this particular level. I know in certain institutions you may not have this uh, particular device available to you, so you can try it with the 45 degree IA tip. Now here's an important thing. You want to set your flow rate to a very, very low flow, maybe around 5 to 10. And you also want to set your bottle height to about, um, let's say, 60 or 55. So you notice that when I grasp the cortex, I'm actually not able to uh, how do I say chew it up or consume it with the IA tip? So what I do is I because my flow setting is so low What what I find is helpful for this particular level and maybe a bit unconventional is that I actually just pull all the cortex away um, from the capsule and Then I use my vitrector which you'll see in a minute to actually um, consume or get rid of the remaining cortex. So there you see my irrigation, and then you see my vitrector, and then I'm cutting up the rest of the uh, remaining cortex. And the reason why I'm doing this is because when I experimented with just the regular IA settings, the machine complained, and the simulator complained, that the irrigation aspiration settings were too high, the irrigation was too high, and then the flow was too high, and they deducted me points. So you have to treat it almost like the level with weak zonules, and so that actually um, got me to get 100 on this particular level. So here, let's take a look at one more attempt. So you stain the, um, the anterior chamber and the bag with the triencimalone, put in your irrigation, and then start with your cutter off until you reach the very bottom, and then you start with your cutter on. So then I, cons I uh, aspirate the rest of the triencimalone, and then I'm starting to cut up the rest of the vitreous. And notice how I'm doing it very slowly at the base first before I start chasing after the vitreous that's in the anterior chamber. And again, you want to be able to make sure that you didn't t t um, tug or pull on any of the uh, vitreous and bring it forward because that will deduct you a lot of points on the simulator. And also make your life a lot more difficult. So now that I'm sure, I'm now going after the rest of the uh, vitreous. Um, notice that I tend to like to pull it 
towards the center where I know it's relatively safe away from the anterior capsule and then I start cutting only when I know that I've uh, gotten a hold of that, that vitreous. And then I stain again just to make sure that I haven't gotten um, or left behind any vitreous. Then I put in my irrigation aspiration and sorry my irrigation and my vitrector and uh, I'm just making sure here at the bottom that I don't have any vitreous left. Just moving the eye around to make sure that uh, it looks good. So then I again I set the irrigation aspiration to a very specific settings. So my settings for this particular level are um, irrigation at 55 uh, or bottle height at 55 and then my flow rate being around 5 to 10. My aspiration or my vacuum stays about the same at around uh, 340 or 350. So I pull and I'm able to get rid of the rest of the, uh, the cortex. I bring it to the middle I did that for that piece there. And here's a little bit of a complication. Some of the vitreous has now kind of escaped towards the edge of where I'm working on that remaining last piece of cortex. So no matter, um, I'm having a bit of trouble. and I finally get the remaining piece. But now it's kind of disappeared inside. That's okay. I, I didn't worry too much at this particular point. Um, I just inserted my irrigation and then my vitrector. I set my aspiration to a really high um, setting, so about 400 or so. And I'm able to just aspirate the rest of the uh, remaining cortex. So here I'm just using the aspiration handpiece. I'm just trying to bring it a little bit in towards the center. It doesn't want to go in for the remaining little pieces. I say, okay, sure, that's that's fine. Just want to clean up that little piece left at the very bottom. And then now I get my vitrector. and I'm able to cut up the rest. So we scored 100 on both attempts. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully this helps with this difficult level and please like and subscribe for more.